it was December 2010 and there was extensive flooding across all of Columbia. I think out of the 32 departments, 28 of them were flooded, so the need was huge. We were putting up tents in a small town called Branca Vieja. The entire town was underwater and the families were just living on the side of a hill. And we were so focused on putting the tents up, you know, working all day and it was really hot and you know, you're so busy trying to get these tents up and it wasn't until the end of the day some of us went and stood up on the top of the hill and you could look out over the whole area and you could see the makeshift shelters they were living in and the flooded town in the distance. And it wasn't until then you kind of got to see the full picture and it was a bit overwhelming just being able to see all the tents put up that we'd done. We put up 55 tents that day and it was a really amazing moment and I just remember feeling like, yeah, like we did that. And when we came back down, the families were starting to move all their belongings into their tent and starting to settle in. And then the music started playing and children were dancing and there was such an amazing atmosphere. And that's because it was Christmas. And it wasn't really until the canoe journey home that evening that kind of everything started to sink in. And I started to think about what my own friends and family would be doing back home for Christmas compared to what this community had been through. And it was quite an emotional evening, but ultimately I remembered that we'd really made a difference to those families. We'd given them somewhere safe and secure to live while they were waiting to go back to their homes. And I'm so proud to have been part of that. Being with my colleagues made it very special and being able to share that festive season with another community who were going through what was a really difficult time for them was really important to me.